Good morning, guys. Another day with old decay. For those of you that are not watching this in the morning, it's not the morning anymore. Good evening. Um, oh my god. It's art. It's art, everybody. If you don't know what art is, this is it. And headbands. Uh, that's art. What is this? Art and architecture bookstore. This is kind of cool. Uh -oh. You're welcome. Let's go in here. Oh, it's very artsy. A house. Blah blah. Do you think she was ticklish? I don't know. Do you think she was? Hi. Hello. Oh, hey, oh my god. <laughs> I was like, I know I know him, but I wasn't sure. Hi. You're just blogging? I'm just <laughs> blogging as you what walk around. What a small around. world. Hey guys, uh, you are on YouTube Jarvis. now. Yes. <laughs> yes. Jarvis. Yes. Rick. Jarvis. Nice Pasha. to meet you. Nice to meet you. What are you doing? Where are you, are you We're going to Kitchen 24. You want to uh, come? You know, I went there yesterday and all of my friends hated it because the service was very slow, so we're going to Umami. Oh. That's, umami's really good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's so good to see you. Good to see the you Kitchen as well. 24. It's, it's walkable? Bad. Yeah. Oh, yeah. cool. Okay, let me stop this. I just had the most amazing experience at Umami Burger. I got myself a truffle burger. So my question today is, this vlog isn't over, but my question today is, uh, in the city that you're living in, do you guys have Umami Burger or is it only in Los Angeles? How much time do I have left? Uh, 15 minutes. So let me just put in some more money into my meter. Sweet, the greatest candy shop on earth. Oh my god, we are on Earth? I didn't know. The Kiri Diaries. I'm super excited about that. Not because she was actually in the Willy Wonka, the movie, when she was little. Now she's big and she has her own show. Okay, sweet. My friend, Little Pepper, uh, she was like, let's go with your sweet. I'm like, what the hell is that? She's like, Olga, you live in this town. You don't know nothing. And I'm like, I don't know nothing. So she's telling me to go to all these places and today we're discovering LA and you guys are coming with me. Okay, so sweet, I think it's, uh, what is this? Never mind. Uh, so I think it's a new candy shop that is located up there, I see it. And right, right now we're at the Hollywood and Highland and we're here by the Kodak Theater. That's where they have the Oscar ceremonies all the time and here on the wall. They have all the movies that have won. So we have 1987, 1986, and you will probably not remember any of those movies. So I'm gonna try to find something that is more relevant. Where would that be? Oh yeah, I see Titanic, 1997, 1996 is the, the English patient. And like all this for is Gump, 1994. All right, so these are the stairs to the theater. <laughs> And that's where they had the theater, the Kodak Theater, where all the movie stars would, I'm out of breath, would be coming. A tea room? Oh my god, there's a tea room? I'm headed to the tea room right Chato. after the suite. Chato? That's the one in the... I know. That's the one in the Koreatown that we we're gonna go tomorrow, so we don't have to, we can just go here. Tea room? Chato. Oh my god, it's so cute. Going there later. And here's... Sweet. We're waiting for the baby. Baby walks slow. So we're waiting for the baby to come up. And we're gonna go to Sweet. And look at that. Look at all this candy. Candy inside the shelves. And fishes. I mean fish is the proper saying. And oh my god. This is not in a candy shop. It looks like, okay, let's look at this. Behold the Wonka windows. From his very first taste, Willy Wonka knew that there was something magical about chocolate. Cute. Look at the Willy Wonka spinning. Da 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 da. All right, the best lawyer. That's not me. Let's do one more. I'll pick this one. The best stepdad. <laughs> I'm the best stepdad. This one. The best tourist. That could be me. All right, they're gonna stop me any second. They're gonna be like, excuse me, can you stop filming, please? All right, so I don't see no candy, but I see lots of freaking stuff like t-shirts and keychains. 
Oh, Hollywood candy. I wonder what that tastes like. Nobody knows me here, so that's good. I ran in into my friends early, but now nobody knows me here, so I can do whatever the hell I want. What? Sticky, sticky, sticky. Sticky. And, uh, oh, it's like a taffy factory. That's so fun. All right, I'm gonna shop. I'm gonna get a whole bag of stuff, and I'll show you what I got later. It's literally like a Willy Wonka candy shop. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God, I almost dropped you. Holy crap. I still have the instincts of a juggler. But look at this. Da, 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 da. Look at the beautiful sexy cow laying here. And a little Christmas tree made of uh, peppermint, pepper canes, pepper canes, sugar canes. Right, so I found this new place and it's called Chocolate Lab. I'm not sure why, but I think it's because it's like a dog, right? And it has Chocolate Lab. Yes, it's a dog, chocolate, I mean it's a lab, chocolate, whatever. So you can make your own candy. Make your own candy. So first you choose, you choose a shell, then you choose a filling, then, uh, what is that? Not meats, okay, choose three add-ins. So you pick three different ingredients, blah, 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 blah. Then they take all of your ingredients and, <laughs> nice. They take all of your ingredients and uh, let me show you. Let me show you real fast. This is like pink berry bar. And they put it all in there. Da 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 da. da, da. Then they stick it into. I don't even know where. Let's see. Let's keep watching. Wow, there's a little bit of salt. I think they put it into the oven, maybe to melt it all together. Look at all this chocolate just pouring over there. So awesome. So then they stick it through a machine. Maybe it's like a freezer, and it's just. Like... I photobombed the kids. <laughs> I want to see it. I photobombed these kids. <laughs> okay. That's doing it. Um, I just photobombed <laughs> everybody. I love doing that. So yeah. So you put your order in here and they make candy for you. I think I should make one. Let's do it. So I'm picking up my own bar right now. So they're gonna create two bars for me and I picked out the ingredients that I wanted. So it's gonna be milk chocolate focus. So I'm gonna picking out milk chocolate with diced almonds, coffee beans, I mean, yeah, coffee beans, <laughs> ginger snaps. So that's gonna be in one uh, chocolate. And then I'm gonna pick white chocolate with peanut butter, caramel, and Pop rocks and coconut and pineapple. Yeah, so the <laughs> got confused. I'm like, wow, there's a lot of toppings inside. So I don't know how long it's gonna take, but I'm gonna submit my order right now. It's seventeen dollars. In case you were wondering, for two chocolate bars to create your own, it's like seventeen dollars. Just a heads up. Just got out of the sweet shop. Look how much stuff I got. Oh my god, can you see that? Can you see that? I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I've got. So, I've created my own chocolate bars. This is my first time opening unboxing chocolate bars with old decay. Let's pull it out. Okay, so, oh, oh no, don't break, don't break. All right, so they're really heavy. They're like, it seems like it's almost like impossible to close them. So we're gonna open them. I'm gonna put you guys right here. Oh yay, are you secure? Okay, good. So. Um, ooh, they are golden ticket, golden wrapper. I think they made me a really big one. I think I have asked for really big ingredients. All right, I really should have dinner before I eat this. Oh my god! All right, so this is the milk chocolate. Oh. It has no designs. So it's a milk chocolate with, um, I think, Pop Rocks. Oh my God, caramel. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. This is really good. If, I w if it wasn't that expensive, I would make this all the time. This is pretty impressive. All right, so I forget what was in this one. You guys probably have a better idea. Oh, it's a pink wrapper. 
It's a pink wrapper for this one. Oh my god. So they have the side openings also, just in case. Ah, screw it. Oh my god, it's not coming out. But they have the side opening so you can open it like a book. I literally, do this shakes my car. My whole car is like. Um, open. Come on. Come on. Okay. All right. Yay. So this one is a white chocolate with. What happened here? They jibbed me. I don't have enough wrapping. All right, so this is white chocolate with, I think this one has pop rocks. This has a lot of dry fruit and stuff. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my God. This is like the best gift ever. Oh my God. This is so, mmm. Mm. Love it. It's a little expensive, but I definitely recommend it. <laughs> and then, oh my gosh, I hope this is gonna fit me well. So you know how much I'm obsessed with peanut butter Reese's, Reese's peanut butter cups? And then what I got for Christmas video, you saw how big the peanut butter cups were given to me as a Christmas gift. They're like this big and they were like almost 11, 1200 calories per each peanut butter cup. So I've decided that it would be just as suiting Soothing, 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 I don't know, uh, to buy myself a peanut butter cup headphones. I mean, Reese's peanut butter, yeah, cups. Um, I'm going to try them on right now. At the store, they look like they were a little too big. But you know what? They're probably old. And these ones are going to be just fine. Come on. I mean, they're not the best, but they're kind of fun. But I've never had nerds rope before. And my friends, they're like, oh my god, ropes! And I'm like, is that that good? So I bought myself. So this one is a holiday edition. And it says one car on it. I don't know what it tastes like. I just tasted, like five minutes ago, I tasted... I doing something crazy. Crazy people, welcome to LA. Uh, so I've tasted the berry one. So in this one, look, it's Christmas. It's a Christmas robe. You see that? Okay, I'm gonna try this. Mmm. Mmm. Oh! I am home. And Roxy is flipping out because I have this new told toy that I got for myself. Glockenspiel? Glockenspiel. Glockenspiel. I think that's the name. What do you want? Go away. All right, so I got this for myself because it makes sweet sound. Roxy. Roxy, do you want to be a musician? Oh my gosh, she's going to sing. This is the first time I see her sing. Roxy, come back. Oh my God, she's a singer. I got this for a little baby because we went to the store. I took him while his mommy and daddy were buying some coffee. We went to the store and he saw this phone and he's like, hello, hello. I said, okay, we'll get you a phone. I so, so much. Hello. You're probably familiar with this, but I want to show you anyways. Hopefully Roxy is not going to steal it from me. I got myself chocolate rock candy. Look, it's rocks. Roxy, no, no, I should, no, sit. Look at those, those are rocks. No, no. Look, they're all different, no. All different colors. And there's a chocolate. I love it. Oh, I missed this thing. Oh no, I should go back and do it. But okay, so it starts with becoming a sleuth. And then it like talks about all the stuff and it gives you homework to find out what sleuth is. So my vocabulary is limited. So I went online, uh, before I went online to research what it is, here's my explanation what I, what I thought it was. First of all, I have no idea what it is, but I'm picturing a slug that is blue and smashed. Okay, let's begin. And then I did my research on what sleuth and sleuthing is. 
and it's carry out a search or investigation in the matter of a detective. So it's like a detective work. So then I, I just finished up the saying, there you have it. It's a slow moving blue detective. Love Olga K. So I really love this book because it makes me, oh, and then it says draw something, uh, fill in this page with stuff. And I said, <laughs> sleuthing, oh no, it says uh, secret intelligent training and it asks you to sleuth the page. So I said, sleuthing the page, and I'm gonna color this blue, and I'm gonna put like a detective hat on it. So I, I drew this guy, and he says, WTF, and then I look like drama from Entourage, and he does. <laughs> I want to be creative. I want to stop smoking, because he's smoking here, and then I said, I don't smoke. Love, Olga K. Uh, anyways, so really cool book i just want to give you an update where i'm at i don't want to show you all of it because then you're not gonna you're not gonna be as excited if you ever get it because you'll be influenced by my ideas and i don't want that so here's where i'm at little pepper gave me this now i know jess has talked about this before and it's certified fair trade dr bronner's magic soaps and you can really use it like 18 different ways you can wash your hair your face your feet your vagina um your you can use it for a bath i mean you could do all of it so while i was in the bathroom i was reading like the warning and it says uh this will clouds if the temperature is below 70. so we're gonna make an experiment and because of all of these books i'm literally like i'm experimenting with everything i'm like discovering the world <laughs> for the first time so i'm gonna put it outside and i think it's gonna cloud and I'm gonna vlog the update tomorrow for you guys so we can see what it looks like once it clouds. I don't even know what that means. I guess it's gonna get like all dirty or something. Oh, and but oh my god, I totally forgot. Okay, so we hit 500,000 subscribers on Olga K channel. Thank you guys so much. I, I'm like freaking out because I made a tiny little video this morning and I'm like, I think we're gonna hit 500,000 by January 4th and I just checked it and it's like 500,000 like even above that now. So I'm so excited. Thank you so much, guys. I love you so much. And this goal is for me to get a million subscribers on YouTube, on Olga K channel, uh, my main channel. And if you watch my videos and if you like them, just tell your friends to watch them and tell your friends to subscribe. And that way we can build the Mush Army Empire really fast. But I'm giving myself a year to get 500,000 more. And I know it's gonna be a lot of work and it's gonna be really hard and I might not succeed, but that's my goal. And for this channel, I don't have huge expectations. I consider you guys like a super, super loyal uh, mooshers and uh, people that are here watching my videos, they're super, super loyal. Um, so I have, I don't have huge expectations. Like if we stay at the same number, great. But I know we do grow every day and that's awesome. So all of you new people, welcome, hello. And then I also have a goal of 150,000 subscribers for my beauty channel. Mooshville. So those are my goals for as far as YouTube goes. Um, so I can't wait to accomplish them. And uh, I'm gonna go. I love you. I'm out of breath. I think I get like nervous when I vlog or something. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Moosh! I'm gonna do a real moosh face because it's 500,000 subscribers. You can't even see me. Moosh! Bye!